And a very good Monday afternoon, everyone. We continue to talk about the winter storm, but the good news is we're starting to see conditions improve a little bit as we go throughout this morning and early afternoon. Taking a look here in Lee Heighton, though, you can see some of the plow trucks out here at the school at Lee Heighton Area High School, kind of taking care of the roadways right now. Snow's kind of diminished a little bit, still some leftover flurries right now, otherwise mainly cloudy. Looking for some snow showers still across the northern tier. You can take a look here in Forest City. Some snow continues to fall. Visibility still reduced quite a bit, and we are going to look for more of those snow showers to continue as we go into the rest of this afternoon. Taking a look at the radar, we had that wintry mix early this morning, especially even some rain farther south, but now that it's getting a little bit colder, we're seeing more of that transition back to snow and some of that stretching over parts of the northern tier into the northern Poconos, so around Wayne County up to around Susquehanna County. If you're Montrose, Springville, you're seeing some of those snow showers kind of pushing on through right now. That's stretching into Lackawanna and Wyoming counties too. Looking at satellite and radar, that system continues to push up to the north. We had that heavier snow from last night well into the parts of New England right now, and now we're just kind of dealing with the wraparound effects with the system, and I do think this will start to slowly taper off, especially as we get closer to this evening. Some of the snowfall totals that we had do shore right close to nine inches of snow. Honesdale, eight and a half. Pocono Pines was close to eight inches as well. Harvey's Lake, nearly five inches. And New Milford, Susquehanna County, around four inches of snow. So send us your weather uh, reports and totals to our email at PA, weather at PA homepage com. Taking a look at the temperatures right now, mostly into the 30s. Currently at 30 in Mount Pocono, 36 Wilkes Barre, Scranton. I have at the freezing mark at Hazelton at 32. And right now, 33 in Pottsville. We've actually seen these numbers fall a little bit since this morning. Some spots were closer to right around 40. As those winds continue to shift out of the west, we'll see these numbers continue to drop as we go into the late afternoon and evening hours. And as we go into tonight, a very cold night shaping up for us, especially with a nice fresh snowpack. Well, that will allow those temperatures to drop into the low 20s, and some spots will once again be into the teens. Looking at future casts as we continue throughout the rest of the afternoon, still dealing with some of the uh, snow showers coming off the Great Lakes and also with the system departing to the north. And it will still continue to be a little bit windy. Those gusts will range anywhere from 20 to perhaps 30 miles per hour locally higher in some spots. Looking at tomorrow, though, still a little bit windy, but at least we'll have the clouds try to break for some sunshine as we go into the afternoon. And then as we head into Wednesday, probably one of the warmest days that we're going to have this week for us. This front will move through. This will bring us an increase in cloud cover and also looking for some late day rain and snow showers for us, but doesn't look anything major compared to what we had last night and for today. Temperature trend over the next five days. We're back to near 40 as we go into Wednesday, but more Arctic air settles back in as we go into the end of this work week. Temperatures on Thursday will be into the 20s, and notice those temperatures overnight for Thursday night and Friday night once again will be into the single digits and only into the teens as we go into Friday. So today with your eyewitness weather forecast, snow showers around and also windy at times. Temperatures will be dropping from the mid to upper 30s back into the lower 30s as we go into this afternoon. Heading into tonight, still some lingering snow showers around, otherwise mostly cloudy. Cloudy and still with that northwest wind, it will be a little bit breezy too. Temperatures for tonight falling into the low 20s and upper teens. Here's a look at your seven day forecast. Overall, pretty quiet as we go throughout this week. Late day rain and snow showers as we go into Wednesday. Temperatures upper 30s to right around 40. We'll look for a little bit more sunshine for the end of the work week, but that comes with colder temperatures as we're into the single digits for both Thursday night and Friday night. And then we're back into the 20s and 30s by next weekend. You can download the Eyewitness Weather app. It's great to have with interactive radar. You can track out the lingering snow showers for today. You can always find more by visiting our website at pahomepage.com. So